Revelation 2192. From the 22nd of December 1941. Spiritual Connectedness. Exchange of Ideas Beneficial. The spiritual bond between people cannot be valued highly enough, as it promotes higher development immensely through mutual exchange and impetus for good. Men can only mature through continuous striving, through constant work on himself and intimate prayer. Will, deed and grace must work together. Where spiritually striving people come together an exchange of thoughts takes place, the result of which is that the human beings will for union with God becomes extraordinarily active, that they seriously strive for union with God and therefore also seriously endeavor to fulfill the requirement which is the prerequisite for this intimate union with God. So the work on oneself begins. The will is put into action, the human being seeks to shape himself correctly, and since he is aware of his weakness he appeals to God for strength and grace. And thus he strives upwards. The human being would tire of this work of the soul if he wanted to separate himself from his fellow human beings, he would lack the impetus, the opportunity to compare and not least the opportunity to serve. For wherever people come together with good intentions, one consciously or unconsciously serves the other. The one who knows tries to give, he tries to make the other also know, the mature tries to spur the immature to work on himself. The strong one gives his strength to the weak one, one will helpfully stand by the other, and all this leads to maturity of soul, for unselfish neighborly love is the binding agent between them and love will always lead upwards. And God's grace will always flow towards these people who unite in order to reach God. The will towards God is decisive as to whether and to what extent the grace of God is imparted to people. Through mutual spiritual exchange of thoughts the will towards God is brought to highest development in the human being, and consequently grace can also flow to him in great measure and this has the effect that the human being can put his will into action and thus work successfully on himself, that his knowledge increases, that he fulfills divine will and enters into an ever more intimate bond with God and thereby also becomes able to establish new connections and to serve his fellow human beings by likewise helping them to ascend. The divine voice and thus God himself expresses itself through people who truly strive to ascend, and therefore spiritual bonds between people will always be blessed, after all, it is God's will that people work together and for each other, that they cultivate love and approach him through love. For only in this way can they mature in their souls and shape themselves into children of God. Amen.